This review is brought to you by BATOYSFORBABOYS.COM, your number one source for all your Mega Bloks needs. Hey guys, it's Ryan back here again. And today we're being Halo Mega Bloks, set number 96978, Halo Series 8. This is the first Hero Pack series for 2014, and each pack is randomly packed. Included with this series is a Promethean Crawler, a Purple Mark 6 Spartan, a Crimson Storm Elite, a Promethean Watcher, a Cobalt Spartan Soldier, a Gold Air Assault Spartan, an Orange Hazop Spartan, and a Green Operator Spartan, which ranges from Common to Rare to Ultra Rare. To start off the Commons, we have the Covenant Storm Elite, who's painted in orange for his eyes, with gray for the detailing, gray for his jumpsuit, and crimson for the armor. And he comes with an indigo storm rifle and a black display stand. Up next is the Operator Spartan, who was previously included with the Pelican gunship and UNSC mammoth sets. He's painted in black for the jumpsuit, green for the armor, gray for the detailing, and gold for his visor. He comes with a gray scatter shot and a black display stand. The third common is the Promethean Crawler with blue Liberian accents rather than orange didact accents with black detailing and silver armor. And it comes with a black display stand. One of the most unique figures in the entire series is the Mark VI Spartan with purple armor. He's also painted in black for the jumpsuit and gold for the visor. Weapons and accessories include a black display stand and a gray scatter shot. And the final common, which is one of my personal favorites, is the Hazop Spartan, who's painted in gold for his visor, black for the jumpsuit, orange for the armor, with silver and gray for detailing. And he comes with a black grenade launcher and a black display stand. Moving on to the rares is the Promethean Watcher, who's mainly painted in silver, and he also has new blue accents, like the Crawler. Weapons and accessories include a black display stand, with a translucent display rod, to give the Watcher the appearance that it's actually flying. The second and final rare is the Air Assault Spartan, who's similar to the Target Exclusive Collector's Edition Pack minifigures, with blue for the visor, Gold for the armor, silver and black for detailing, and black for the jumpsuit. He comes with a gray grenade launcher, and a black display stand. And to wrap things up, is the ultra rare Spartan Soldier, who technically can be considered a nod to Marco from Fireteam Majestic. He's painted in a bluish steel color for the armor, black for the jumpsuit, and gold for the visor. Weapons and accessories include a black display stand and an indigo storm rifle. There's also three additional mystery minifigures, which I currently do not have pictured, including a green translucent Spartan recruit, a black translucent elite zealot, and an orange translucent Promethean watcher. So series 8 of hero packs is surprisingly mediocre. Compared to the previous 20 minifigures included with series 7, going back down to 11 minifigures, can be both good and bad. While it's easier to acquire a complete set now, it also lacks variety, which Mega tried to make up for by including some odd colors and Prometheans into the mix. But there's still some good apples out of the bunch, which I definitely recommend you try to hunt down. So anyways, that pretty much does it for this review. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you all in the next video. Subscribe for hundreds of collectible reviews, including Halo and Star Wars, and follow me on Facebook and Twitter for up-to-date channel news.